It's all a little harder, for sure. It's uh, all so hard. So, yeah, but I, that, like, I don't want to eat leave. four pounds of meat every hour. On the road. <laughs> On the road. On the road. But Sean the Razor Bozell, mm. who is thinking about not competing at the competition due to a uh, strain serratus, which he's known for for being extra sharp. Not the serratus, but my uh, <laughs> abdominal muscle. Do you think you can do bench only today? I've thought about doing it. I'm going to talk to Spiro and see what he says. But what did the doc give us a uh, some info about what the doctor said about the injury? The doctor said I should not compete, and that more than likely I either have a strain or a tear in the muscle. And this happened on Monday from doing speed work with 275 on deadlifts? Yes. Did, did you feel the pain immediately, or was it something that got yes. worse as a day? I uh, felt it pretty much right after my set. It was a real sharp pain, and, uh, you know, that point on, I decided to, to stop deadlifting. It was on my seventh set, I believe. I was right. working, you know, pretty hard. And that was uh, your last training session, too, right? Yeah, and then uh, I did some bench press after that, and the pain just kind of persisted, so. Hmm. Well, hopefully it's nothing too serious, and uh, hopefully you'll be able to bench tomorrow. <clears throat> and uh, what were you planning on hitting if you weren't injured? Well, uh, I plan on getting over 1,000 pounds in the 165 class, and I plan on getting uh, like a 370 squat, 240 bench and like a 405, 410 deadlift. That would have been the goals if you were 100% healed right now. Yeah. Hopefully you'll be able to be good for January's raw record breaker, which is I believe in two months. Yeah, I think it's. Yeah, I think it's like two and a half months. Ten weeks or so. Ten, eleven weeks. Yeah, it's about 2.5 months out. So hopefully you're good to go then. Stay safe in the meantime and uh, get us to the competition safe. Yeah, we're at a red You're safe right to now. drive, right? The, do the doctor said you're safe to drive, right? Yeah, the doctor said <laughs> okay. I can drive. You know, I can have sex. I can... Uh, <laughs> whoa, whoa. You, you can know. have sex, but you can't squat or bench or deadlift? <laughs> <laughs> Just, you know, short strokes, basically. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> Maybe on bottom. <laughs> All right. All right, so that's the razor. <laughs> and back here, who is this guy? Holy... What's up, bitches? It's Brody from GNC. I'm back, and I'm black. Okay. <laughs> no racist. No All right. Racist. So, uh, you know, man, YouTube hasn't seen you in a half a year. What, what, what's up, guys? What's been up? I'm back. Uh, we're on our way to Palm Bay, Florida. You know, um, on the other side of the coast. No, I don't think they do know Cody. <laughs> uh, hey, it's first off, Sean the Razor Basel. Bosel. You, you can't remember. You can't interrupt, Brody. All right, well, I got some questions for you, Brody. Oh, right. my bad. Um, so, uh, powerlifting meet. Um, talk about, you know, the past week, what you were trying to do. You're, I believe All you are right, trying to well, make weight. Um, truthfully, you know, I was, I was thinking about doing the 165, you know, days ago. I was trying to cut weight. Um, taking every supplement under the sun, as you know, of course. Um, you know, fuck my liver. <laughs> so, anyways, I mean, eating Quest bars out the ass, you know, trying to double up on the fiber since fiber, you know, is a natural detox for your body. So, long story short, plan fucking failed. I got a little, you know, I was just chilling in my house, in my apartment one day, and I had some uh, leftover cooking utensils from Halloween. Decided to bake a cake. You know, a little protein uh. cake. You know, but, uh, you know, it was pretty good. Decorated it, put uh, sprinkles on it, made it a fucking fairy tale, you know what I mean? Long story short. Long story short. <laughs> yeah, he spilled over. I spilled over. <laughs> so, spilled you, over so you were more. weighing like 176 about a week ago, and you got down to 173? Three. Got down to 173 last night. You know, I was going to have to drop a bunch of water weight, and then... Uh, then said fark it. Right? I said fark. Falcon, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so you're going way anyone. What, what are your plans at the meet uh, at this uh, well, competition? Well, today, uh, you know, well, my plans. I'm planning on going for a 420 pound deadlift. 
You're pretty much just trying to break your total record, right? Break my total, yeah. You know, just trying to break the total. Wait and a at, second, what did you get last fun. time? You can get more than 420. I think I got 415 last time. Yeah. So, I, I, that's what, so I'm trying to go for Dude, 420. Dude, I think oh. you can get 440. Oh, my boy thinks I can go for 440. So that goes to show, YouTube, I've been training deadlifts for quite a while. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right. I've been, I've been, I've been learning some form from the famous uh, George Lehman. Watch out, y'all. All right, all right. So that, that's Brody from GNC. Oh, by the way, eat steak. It has creatine. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Now, last but not least in the car is B Rye. What's up? What's also, up? not seen on my channel in months, but uh, going for some big numbers today. Finally, in the 181s for the first time, right? Yeah, it's my first time. M181 and uh, 175 right now. So. Going for at least a 1,200 pound total, right? Yeah, I hope I hope to be getting. Yeah, because you're a good 10 pounds heavier than you were at 165. So. Yeah, plus I've been relaxing like hardcore. I haven't moved a muscle in like 10 days. And you've been uh, eating a lot too, right? Eating a shit ton. Basically, eating, trying not to be the 165 class. Yes, <laughs> trying to lose my abs, <laughs> trying yeah. to lose some people. Yeah. After Brian gets to 170, it's hard for him to gain weight after that. And uh, he's got to drink olive oil to gain any weight after 175. <laughs> olive oil shit. Brody looks at olive oil and gains 10 pounds. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so that's about it. We're about, <clears throat> about a half an hour, 45 minutes of this car drive now. And uh, we have about another two and a half hours to go. So we'll stay tuned.